About two years ago, on August 16th, I, uh, on a trampoline in our backyard, had an accident and essentially did a backflip poorly, broke my neck. I'm now a quadriplegic, much better than I was then, and came here in search of an answer. We left on Independence Day, which is perfect, and I did it on purpose because I want to be independent. That condition, not being able to feed yourself, not being able to do anything around bowel or bladder, can't bathe yourself, lying in a bed, hopeless. I went through several weeks of evaluation of, is life worth living? And then once I made that determination that I was going to stick around, I could say, am I getting better? Can I keep this up? Do I keep looking for means to improve myself? My name is Jack Pierce. I'm from Jacksonville, Florida, back in the United States. And my wife, Ellie, we've been married 38 years and she's here helping me through this process. The stem cell research uh, began probably a year after uh, the accident. And I uh, fell upon um, uh, Baker and its affiliate hospital. They could offer not only the, the stem cells at a much higher level, but this uh, particular hospital offers a, a holistic approach. So, yes, I'm, I'm crippled, but they want to make sure the entire body is, uh, is addressed through the acupuncture, the diet, uh, magnetic stimulation, then physical therapy, occupational therapy, and uh, aquatics. So it's not just come in, get the stem cells, mm -hmm. go home, and hope something happens. And I don't think there is a magic bullet. The stem cells by themselves are an element of it, like a foundation, but you really have to build upon it with and create demand for your, your muscles through intense physical training. And this arrangement here is unique and powerful. That's my belief. And based on the research that I've done, I'm pretty confident of that statement. Hello. Do you want me to transfer to? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Ah. Our approach here is a bit uh, different from the conventional practice. Right? In conventional practice, when you want to uh, the patient to get the rehabilitation, you uh, go to the physical rehabilitation unit, right? But we see that that in the chronic conditions, right, everything have to come together. Mm -hmm. Thumb, uh, thumb to touch your index finger and its finger. Of course, it's really difficult to, to see whether the patient gets better from hyperbaric oxygen, from acupuncture, or from aquatic exercise. But uh, in the perspective of the patient, who cares? Yeah. Right? So, so we are here to try to, to, to support, to help people. And the best moment is when you help people to know their power to, to heal themselves. And that, that's keep my passions alive. Okay, so I would like to shake your uh, muscle power. Yep. Okay, do you like it? Go on, okay. So again, my power. Okay. One, two, three. Okay, good. <laughs> it's not gonna work like you get the stem cell and you ask people to wait for a magic to happen. It, it never worked like that. You still have to provide the signal from, from your act, uh, extremity back to your brain. That's the reason why we, we want people to get very healthy, right? And you still have to fight for that and you have to understand. Uh, and all this treatment, this modality is just the option to help you to get better chance. Jack, you know, he, he's a good candidate. He has commitment. The level of injury is right, you know, so far he, he has a determination. You know, there, there's going to be a rough part for sure, right? It's not an e easy way up, right? There's going to be up and down for sure. And, and, and he's the kind of guy that, that, that uh, can get through that moment. I bend your knee, you feel it? No, not at all. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> hopefully next week that changes. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> 
if I walked or not, wasn't important. Can I be independent and not be a burden to, to everyone? And I say a burden, my wife will tell you, I'm not a burden, you know, it's, it's something that we'll just deal with. Mm -hmm. But it's unfair burden to everybody. So independence is critical in the objective, main objective. That was a short-term objective for a year um, <laughs> that we have. You paralyze all the body, right? All the body. Only your face, only your... Correct. You can move, right? Yes, two oh. years ago. That's why I came to Bangkok I to do the stem cells and the um, implant stimulator.